Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Stephanie. I am the Opinionated Horsewoman. So today, you guys, I have two things I received in the mail to unbox with you guys. You want to see what they are? Be proud of you know it's in the title. But if you want to see what I got, let's get into it. So first thing I'm going to show you guys is the BoxyCharm add-ons or pop-up or whatever they were called last month. I feel like they were just pop-up. Um, didn't order a ton of stuff, but I did order some of my tried and trues, and then I got uh, a couple new items. So I have been ordering these uh, a lot. You guys are going to laugh. I got more of the Glamnetic um, magnetic eyelashes. I've really been enjoying them. You guys, it's just so much easier than the old fashioned glue on. So these are the baby girl and I got four pair. I'm not out of the old pair. Um, some of these last a long time and some of them only last me a couple days. It's so strange. <laughs> I take as good a care of them as I always try. So I don't know what to tell you, but I ordered four more. <laughs> So we'll see. We'll see how these do. And then on that note, they have the other brand, which is uh, Moxie Lash, I think. What are these? I don't know what these are. Okay. The, well, these are a magnetic eyelash set. It's from Bella Bellax US. I don't something beauty. They're <laughs> I don't know what they are. It's a magnetic eyeliner and lash set. So it comes with the lashes. In this case, it comes with an uh, applicator, which I don't really need, and then their magnetic lash eyeliner. So I kind of wanted to try this. <clears throat> I had a couple different things in my cart, you guys. Um, I think Moxie Lash may have been in there last month. And I just decided ultimately to try this. So this is what it looks like. I'm hoping it won't fall. <laughs> I have a bunch of these. They work great for doing this, you guys. But let's take a look at the, whoa, oh, it wouldn't be me if I didn't throw it around, try to drop it. Uh, how do you do this without, seriously? There we go. <clears throat> All right, well, there's a little mirror and then the lashes are, <clears throat> it's cute, you guys. It's very cute. It's got a little glittery thing in the background. I'm not sure why, other than it's cute and to keep the, <laughs> Whatever, but this is what the lashes look like. Um, and I didn't get anything too totally wild. I wanted something, you guys, I don't wear anything more wild and crazy than what I'm wearing. So that is what the lashes are. It's just the one pair. Uh, and then their liner, if I can get it out. Just a cutesy little liner. We'll see, you guys. I don't. It wasn't a lot of money. Um, Six, nine, twelve bucks somewhere in there. I don't know. Um, nothing awful. There's a little insert here. Talks about how to apply. Let's see what they say. You apply the magnetic eyeliner along your lash line generously. Let it dry about one to two minutes. Then you remove your lash strip using your tweezers. You stick them in there. It's the same concept. <laughs> it's magnetic eyeliner and lashes. So I'll be curious to see how they work out. Um, I don't know how quickly I'll try them. Um, I think I'm on my possibly third week with the lashes I'm wearing right now, which is a little shocking. Like I said, sometimes they last me like a good long time and sometimes they fall apart after like day two. So it's so strange. Um, what I do find is that the band starts to unravel or the uh, magnets come off. And so far these have been pretty good, but I'm really careful about just being very careful about picking like the eyeliner off because when you pull these off, you pull the eyeliner off with it. So we'll see you guys. And then the last item um, was free because I spent over a certain dollar amount. So I got Half Cakes Totally Tubular Mascara. Totally Tubular. That is like 80s, right out of the 80s. So I thought, why not try it, right? Um, it's called The Heights. Uh, I don't think it's supposed to be anything colorful. Let's look, I'm scared. 
I don't really need to open another mascara, but now I'm a little scared that I ordered some strange colored mascara and don't even know it. I don't know, you guys. This is what it looks like. I guess we can see what it looks like, right? It's called The Heights. Mm. That's black. Ooh, I like that wand. That's cool. I like it. I like the look of that applicator. Um, we'll try it. So I got it for free for... I don't know. I think I got a coupon. That was what it was. I got a coupon code. If I spent more than X dollars, you got certain something free and this ended up being free. So, uh, it says vegan approved and babe tested. Not really much else on here other than the ingredients. It is made in China. Um, yeah, I don't know. Half caked, totally tubular mascara. So that's it guys. I mean, I didn't really order a lot. I'll be curious to try these flash lash. And of course, I've been ordering a bunch of those. I still have some left over, so I guess I'm hoarding now. But that's what I got. Let me know what you guys think of that. Like I said, it was last month's boxy pop-up order. Um, today was choice day for the next box. So I got in and got my choices. I started shopping and I just got out. Because, you know, last month um, it just the site crashed. So I was happy to get my choice in and then I just got out. So the next item I've got, you guys is glow addict beauty glow addict beauty box i thought it i ordered a couple things from them this is the first i'm gonna make sure i don't cut anything here um so yeah let's get into it i believe this is their box so let's see what i got guys first thing that rolled out is b bella lip perfection pencil if you guys can see that, hopefully, I don't know. That's the color. It is nicely shrink wrapped. Uh, let's see if I can figure out what the color is called. 015 in Babe. So very nice color, kind of a nude pencil. The next item is nicely bubble wrapped. It is Millennial Beauté Sea Breeze CBD Toning Drops. Um, yeah. I don't know, you guys. I'm not real excited about this. Um, if you look at, this looks like homemade, very kind of like printed off in a hurry on a crappy printer. Like the text is not... It looks rubbed off or like it barely came through. Um, yeah, I don't know. You can't even read it. It's so light. It's, I don't know, you guys. It just, has anybody tried this, received it? I'm suspicious. But this is a CBD toning drops. Even the bottle kind of looks a little dusty. I don't, I don't know, you guys. My suspicions are up on that one. <clears throat> okay, this one is Molly Jacob All Eyes on Me. It's a brush set. So it says designed and formulated in Florida, filled and assembled in the People's Republic of Ch China or PRC. Let's take a look. So it's a four piece brush set. So all for eyes. Actually looks pretty nice. Uh, I'm not going to touch them though, guys. I am getting a lot of brushes through my subscription from Makeup Institute slash Hank and Henry. So these will probably go in the giveaway pile. Okay, the last item. It's just bubble wrapped again. Zodiac Collection from Beauty Treats. This is very pretty. It's a eyeshadow palette and it's seven pans. Very, very cute. Really pretty colors, you guys. Very, very pretty. Reasonable size. You could probably get this into a bag, you know, like a handbag. Uh, let's see what it says. Um, cruelty free. It is made in China. So this is a Chinese made palette. It says it is cruelty free and distributed out of Los Angeles, California. And it's beauty-treats.com. But really pretty colors. Uh, almost, I would say almost all like shimmery. 
definitely look all shimmery. Like these are very distinctly shimmery, but even these ones that have a tendency to look kind of matte actually have a bit of a shimmer to them. Um, but they might be matte. There's a, there's a, like a shrink wrap sticker around it, so you can't open it. But beautiful colors, you guys. Really, really, really nice, pretty colors. So almost neutrally with a hint of color. I, I like it. I think it's really very pretty. So uh, that's what I got in this. What do you guys think? Pretty palette. And a brush set to put the shades on with, right? And a nudie lip pencil. Again, the color was Babe 015. And this is Be Bella. Very nice nude, almost like a nude colored lip lip liner. Um, and then this Seabreeze CBD. I can't hardly read it. It's You can barely read the text. Self-toning drops, I think. Nothing's really legible besides where it says Seabreeze and Millennial Beauté. I don't know, you guys. I don't know about that one. I'm really suspect on this. Like I said, my spidey senses are kind of going off on this. Like, not impressed with the fact you really can't read anything on the label. Um, and the label looks kind of like haphazardly put on. I don't know. This is really weird. And the whole thing looks kind of dusty. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Let me know if you've used it. But this is, I don't have a lot of experience with Glow Addict. Like I said, I got a, another couple things coming. So those should be uh, here shortly. Maybe even my next video. But this is nice. Nice. And very nice. So let me know what you guys think. Two items unboxed today. You know, nothing really exciting in either one as far as like quantities. But really cool stuff, I think. <laughs> a lot of stuff about like all about the eyelashes with boxycharm <laughs> and then um yeah some nice makeup items and um uh, cbd oil or something so thanks so much for joining me you guys and uh make sure that i don't forget to mention i do have a subscriber giveaway going on i am pushing to hit 1775 subscribers you need to be um publicly subscribe to my channel and my Instagram channel. Uh, I have a two-part video. I do the first part, kind of showing you guys what I initially put in the giveaway. And then before I even published that, I decided I wanted to add a bunch more in and did a second video. I probably could have combined them. I don't know. I was... The first one was already uploaded. I probably should have just reshot the whole thing, but I did it that way. So part one and part two, you should watch. You'll need to leave a comment on part one and the rules are all on that part one video. You'll want to see everything that's in part two. So you know everything. It's a really nice giveaway, guys. So check it out and uh, yeah. Hope you guys will consider joining my channel if, uh, if you are new here. Join my YouTube family and thank you again to all my returning family members. You guys are amazing. You've been so supportive of me and my attempts to continue to grow my channel. And uh, yeah, this giveaway is absolutely how I hope to give back to you guys. So I got lots more in kind of in the hopper planned for the future. I had set a goal at the beginning of this year to try to hit 2000 by the end of the year. I don't know if I'm going to do it, but I am going to try really hard to. So this is one way I'm trying, guys. So thank you again. I hope you're having a great week. And I will see you all on my next video. Bye, everybody.